Hello everybody, welcome to Andrew Does a Thing. My name is Andrew, and today Hello, I am going to make Mario in MS Paint. So let's get on that right now. So, since my previous picture was Terran, and Ter from Terran from Link's Awakening, and Terran is basically an ant. Basically, I'm pretty sure he was uh, designed off of Mario. So we're just going to reuse this for today's stream. <laughs> Let me do this. Get my little rough area set up. Because I am lazy. So. <laughs> do this. Hey, Mario already has mushrooms, so I can keep that. But, let's get rid of all this. By painting it in with white. Oh, the little button is still there. Okay. Let's get rid of his neat little ascot, because Mario doesn't have one of those, we all know that. Mario just has a plain red shirt with overalls. So, oh, he also has blue pants. Blue pant ad, there we go. With overalls, so blue, that's supposed to be black. That that that's supposed to I I was supposed to change the color. That's a very bad line. Let's just paint that in. There we go. And let's draw a hat and call this stream done. <laughs> uh, hat. Alright, so I guess I gotta erase this dude's hair. Because his hair won't be poking out the side. I can leave some of the hair for now. Let's, uh... Dang it. I thought I switched the color. Why? 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 There we go. Sometimes MS Paint does that. Sometimes MS Paint won't let you switch to a color that you want. And then for his brim, something like that. We could just erase all this. I'm just gonna fill this in. Bloop, bloop. Oh, I should probably, uh, let me, here, hold on a sec here. Let me just neaten this up a wee bit. Don't want to be too unprofessional here. <laughs> bloop, 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 bloop. And a circle of life. Or the circle of M, I guess. And a big ol' red M. There we go. There we go. There's Mario. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. Bye. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm actually going to draw him from scratch, but I thought this would be a funny little gag. I am, however, going to keep this picture because I think it's funny. Um, so give me a second to save that. Taryn as Mario 
dot png. All right, <laughs> so that's not bad. I think he's got a couple little buttons on his overall, overall z with an s. Here, I think. I don't know. Let's just save that. There we go. And all right. So that's that's not bad. <laughs> but yeah, I'm like I said, I'm gonna I'm gonna just do it new. Hold on. Let me just make sure it's saved to the right place. Yes. Okay. Good. All right. So file new. And I'm gonna do my normal little thingy of in case I need a uh, uh, rough area. Do that. Now Mario. So start him from scratch. So I'm I'm gonna draw him in my style. I guess you could say. Um, but yeah. Um do, do 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 Just give me a second. Gotta get my re reference. There we go. Mr. Mario. Mario Mario. Alright. So, let's see here for a second. So, and make his face like that. Nope, that's not good. Let's do what I should do and start with a rough circle for his head. And then I can draw over that to get a better sort of proportion. Uh, or do I want to make his noggin a little bit bigger? No, that's probably right. <laughs> so with the Mario characters, they aren't proportioned quite like the Link's Awakening characters are. The Link's Awakening characters have bigger heads in proportion to their bodies than Mario characters normally have. So it'll be a little bit smaller his noggin, and he's. Uh, far too big. Hmm. Okay, I don't need a straight... Hold on, hold on. Okay, so... For whatever reason, making... the... the... the, the, the head really really messes with me sometimes. Uh, that's a little bit bigger than I want. Alright. So Mario. Alright, let's just get a head shape and then I can adjust it as necessary down the road. I don't think uh, the back of his head needs to be this big. <coughs> So, again, I'm going to do just, just kind of, I guess you could say slots for eyes. I don't know if that's the right way to put that. And uh, I keep hitting this A button when I want to hit the undo button. There we go. That sort of looks like a Mario nose. Here, let's... Uh, Maybe I should have just stuck with the previous picture. <laughs> no, it's fine. I'll figure something out. 
Uh, I, this doesn't look very Mario-like. This looks... Oh, it looks very familiar. Looks like... What's his name? Uh, kind of like Captain Olimar, actually. I've never played the Pikmin games, but... Sort of has that look about him. I don't know, I could be wrong. I haven't, like I said, I haven't played Pikmin games. So, I don't really know. Don't really have what he looks like in my mind very well. Anyways, back to the picture. So, here's Mario. fashion Mario stash. There we go. Okay. I guess the I'm sort of making the paper Mario version of Mario unintentionally here with the styling. The way it kind of matches the way I am making MS Paint people currently. That's not quite what I wanted. But anyways, um, so yeah. Let's give Mario a slightly stronger jawline. Not too strong, he doesn't have like a squarish jaw, which that is sort of, but you know. He doesn't have the... Hold on. Ah, oh, that'll do for now. So... I, once again, I don't... I, hmm, I, hmm. Alright. Just taking a second to, to save um, my rough image here. Okay, so Mario's hat will be something like this, and the the brim will be something like this. No, it won't be. It'll be something more like this. do this kind of make not quite like that not quite like that sort of like that there we go and his hair is whoops I keep out I got like 15 different things open right here I got like Obviously, OBS open for streaming stuff. There we go. There's his. There's his. Uh, not his bangs. What? Why can't I think of the word? Ah, shut up. <laughs> why can't I think of the word? His, his, his mutton chops. That'll that'll do for now. And then he's nope. That's more of a mullet. Just wanted to kind of not like that. All right. Sort of like that, but not really. That'll do for now. This is probably going to be a really bad picture of Mario. But then again, who knows? Who knows how it's going to turn out? Okay. <laughs> let's move his head up a little bit. Actually, no, let's not. Okay, so. Now, this portly plumber has no neck, apparently. Which is fine by me. I've 
never drawn Mario before. Uh, then again, I've never drawn many of the characters I've drawn on stream before either. Especially not that that uh, big old big old dang mech from Front Mission Three that I drew last week. Yes, last week, last Thursday, I believe it was. All right. So, anyways, okay, that's a very weird looking shoulder. That that is too. I don't think anybody should have a weird hump on their shoulder like that. I probably had a good line before, but I didn't really use it. Okay, that's not good. Okay, you know what? Let's just undo all this. Do, do, do. It draws overalls first because that'll help kind of get the rest of the proportion for me. I might have to extend this image down a little bit, but we'll see. Okay, so his overalls actually kind of. Okay. Hold on. I'm making a right mess of this. There we go. Something like that, and he's got big old buttons here. And then, I guess I can erase this line, because it's not really useful to me. Bloop. Okay. a very weird looking Mario. I'm, I'm probably going to change something. Probably change his face around a little bit. Actually kind of looks a little bit more like maybe Luigi a bit. I don't know. Anyways. So he's got his portly little gut. that. And that was supposed to be a leg, but the line kind of went wibbly wobbly, wobbly, and just didn't, just didn't look good. That doesn't look very good right now. All right. My commentary is probably just amazing right now, and because uh, I'm kind of this is messing me up for some reason. You know, sure, a giant robot, fine, but but a portly plumber, I'm having difficulties with. Okay, not quite. All right, it's probably because I. I haven't even like thought of what kind of a pose I was going to put him in. I was just like, yeah, I'll draw Mario on stream, and boom, there we go. I, I, huh. Most of my other ones, I've, I've thought of this beforehand, but I, I didn't think of that today for some reason, because, uh, reasons. Anyways, let's do this. Let's pull this strap back a little bit, and that might look a little better. Let's get rid of this floating pixel here and these ones there. And uh, make this his... Hmm. 
interesting. Me, I'm doing bad job. That kind of just makes it look worse. <laughs> All right, you know what? Uh, hmm. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to draw some rough stuff in just to get proportions down. So I'll use a light gray color just to get the idea of what I want to draw here. So uh, let's actually move over a bit. just not just not it's just not clicking with me today all right so his body will be like hold on yeah, it's just not, I'm just not having a good time of it right now. I think I just need to completely redo this shoulder area. Something, yeah, something just looks off here. So let's, hold on, let's, uh, before I do anything here, So I want to go back to it. All right, now let's get rid of all of this, all this junk here. Maybe that was a mistake, I don't know. But uh, let's see here, so. clicking for me today man okay he's not he doesn't have that big of a gut so his torso will be about this size actually it's not quite he, he has like a sh very short torso I said short okay so and then So once again, this line is just rough, just for me to get the proportions in. Okay, that's one leg. It's the other leg. Shoe. Shoe. Yeah, something doesn't look right with the proportions here.
either. What is going on? You know what it is. I made his head too big for the picture. So let's for for the size I allotted. So let's drag this down. There we go. Now I can just get rid of all this stuff and start over from scratch. Maybe I could even move this out of the way. Maybe I'll just readjust that as I see fit later. All right, bloop. It also doesn't help that on my screen, my screen is cracked in a few places, and the the uh, the pixels are like dead in a certain area or dying. And one of these areas is like right around here. There's some more over here. Some at the top of my screen. Basically, I have a laptop and I dropped it a few years ago. And I haven't really been able to afford a new one. So, um, I have a, have, I've had to use a broken screen for years, which is not fun. It's not really that fun at all. But I've, I sort of just, I guess, like tune it out now. I've learned to just like it's like just not a thing anymore. Anyways. Uh I don't know what that line was exactly supposed to be. Oh boy. I'm uh I'm just not doing a good job here. song from one of the Mario 64 levels stuck in my head. I believe it's the first level. I can't remember what it's called. I haven't played that game in quite some time now. It has been a while. Oh. Oh, jeez. One thing I could do here is make it look like everything is facing the right way. Because I got Mario kind of facing this way, but I'm kind of drawing the body as if it's facing forward. Yeah, that might actually help a little bit, and then this like overalls come up a little bit higher than that. So let's get rid of this line. Something like that, and. Then You know, that's looking better. That is looking better. It's looking, you know, in proportion with what Mario actually looks like. And then one leg. That's a little long, I think. Once again, this light gray line is just rough, just so I can get an idea of the proportions. And then his arm, and 
hand, arm, hand. Okay. So I'm not going to do that. I'm going to like. I don't know what exactly pose I'm going to make. I didn't think of this, and that really, really helps <laughs> to know what you're doing when you head into something. songs. Some catchy music in the Mario franchise. One thing Nintendo knows how to do really well is make games with incredibly awesome music. You know? I mean, their games are just really good and fun overall, but like, the music is just, it's just great, you know? It's, you know, a lot of it is very fun and catchy, you know? Just, just, just real good stuff. Those composers over there at Nintendo. Good job, guys. Anyways, um, I think I have an idea. But we'll see. Alright, so now that I've got those proportions look pretty good. I'll draw over them with black so that I can actually get some good lines going. And then I'll erase the So this isn't bad. Whoops. Actually, like the direction this one's going automatically. Whoops. Automatically? I don't think that's the right word I wanted to use. But. Alright. Here, we'll get a whoops. Get a button over here. Um, line, so I'll just paint it black, I didn't, except I forgot to disconnect this part, there we go, and I'll just do that.
sec here. Oh no. Frick. Oh well, whatever. Alright. Make Mario's legs a little shorter in this picture. Than I than I had in the uh the outline there. Something like that. Whoops. Except uh doing wrong. There we go. I like these lines, so I'll keep them. They seem to be pretty decent. Alright, so let's get Mario's... What is he going to do with his left hand and arm? resting on his hip like this. Whoops, that is a bad looking hand. That looks up marginally better. But only marginally. So if he's holding his hand like that, so that'll be his pinky. So then his hand will be kind of like scrunched up like that. I'm just making a mess of this, aren't I? I'm not the greatest at making hands, so I apologize for my lack of artistic abilities. But uh, give me a sec here. So, let me give myself a little more room to work with here so that I can get enough detail in the hand so it looks like a hand. So that'll be like his palm. That'll be his pinky curling. Uh, does that... that doesn't look anything like a hand. That just looks weird. Looks like he's got sort of like a hook for a hand or something, something weird going on there. Oh, oh, I see what it is. I, his palm should be kind of coming up. All right, you know what? Mm. You know, that doesn't look too bad if I, maybe if I erase this up a little bit. God, he's got like a glove. It's like a like a collar on the glove. Collar is that? <sighs> I just made it worse. I am good at that. All right, and also uh, his arm looks just weird here. So let's could probably keep this, but. Nope, nope, nope. It's not the direction I wanted it to go. Something like that. I'm just making it worse. Maybe I'll... Maybe I don't know. Man. Oh! I... I, I don't think anybody's watching, but if they are, cool. Um... But anyways, if you are watching, 
I finally bought some equipment that might help me uh, play some video games so you don't have to watch me make uh, MS Paint pictures of wildly varying qualities. <laughs> you know? Like I can make a mech pic that surprises me, but I can also screw up on making a cartoon hand. So that's fun. Um, I'm not even the full view of the hand, you know? Like, how do I, how do I... Okay, so maybe I won't have his hand leaning on... Oh, I am just making a mess of this picture. Sorry for that sniffle. I don't know if uh, it was sharper, uh, too sharp a noise or anything, but I hope not. Let's try this one more time. So the palm of his hand will be like that, because this will be the back of his hand. I don't want to put detail lines there, because then that's just going to... How's that looking? Looks a little better. Looks a little better. Oh, my phone's going off. I'll ignore it for now. If it's important, they'll leave a message. If not, well, then they won't. At least I hope that's the idea. Because if it's important and they don't leave a message, then what are they doing? Uh, anyways, so... Alright, so I'm gonna try to make this hand... Uh, be shooting the peace sign, or the victory sign, whatever. I think it's both. It could be both. Basically, you know, holding your index and middle finger up to form a V-looking thingy. The peace sign, as I think it's most commonly referred to as. So let me go back to using gray, so I can get an idea of how that, that'll look. Okay, so that, that went way too far. Um... So I'll have his elbow coming up, like that, or is that right? And then his hand will be around here, or, hmm, hmm, alright, you know what, let's make this gray again, because that's probably, actually, you know what? I'm going to need to know where, uh... And the V sign will look like... And I'll make... Should I make Mario with three fingers like I did with my other characters? No, because that'll look weird, only having... Alright, so... This one finger will be like this, and another finger will be like this. His thumb will come across like this, 
and one finger will be like this, one finger will be like this. There we go. So that's not bad. I mean, it's not great. I'll have to edit it a little bit, but that, that gets the general shape across pretty well. Maybe I'll change the location of his elbow or none, all that stuff, but... Yeah, it doesn't look too bad. Mm, this hand, I think, needs to be a little bigger to match the size of this one, though, so... Let's, uh... Let's get to it. Hold on. That's a weird look at them. Okay, that doesn't look good. That just I don't know make it look so good in the rough picture, but no. Yeah, I'm doing a bad job. That's fine. It'll all come together eventually, maybe. <laughs> oh wait, hold on. It's pinky, so maybe it maybe it'll look better if it doesn't even reach like that. Sort of. Sort of looks good. Let's do some here. Let's Let's actually make his Index finger a little bit wider to mm, I'm just making it look worse and worse, aren't I? I'm getting the idea down, but it just looks weird. Alright, let me let me undo the crap out of this. Okay. Let's go back to using light gray for a second. Something about that was messing with me. His arm was looking a little out of shape there. Okay, I guess I can get rid of all this since it's going to be obscured by his arm. Yeah, that looks a little better. But I think his hand needs to be up a little bit, actually, so... Do this. Let's just get rid of all this. You know what? Let's get rid of all this. And, uh, whoops. Still wanted to do this for a second. Actually, hold on. If I do this, this arm's going to be longer than that arm. So, oh boy. I've just made a mess.
minutes of this, so... So his hand should be around here then, maybe. I can redraw it later. Okay, so. And then that'll be is the collar for the glove. And that looks a little bit closer to being. Still doesn't quite look right. I am just doing a bad job at this. I am so sorry for all of you who have to witness this. This is just... This is embarrassing. <laughs> Alright. Like that, except this needs to be a little bit further out. No, 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 no.
is that looking? It is better. It's getting closer to what I want. Maybe, um, I'm sort of using my own hand, my own right hand to kind of get the angles right as a reference. It's not really working as well as I had hoped. better that's better that's starting to actually look like a hand now all right the persistence pays persistence pays you keep at something long enough and more than likely you'll get better at it even if it's drawing a hand you know that's not too bad that isn't too bad it isn't great but it's not too bad all right, now let's attach it to the That's not too bad. I could edit that and muck about with it. You know what would have been easier? No, but no, no, that's true. Would have been easier if he'd shown the peace sign with the back of his hand facing forward, but all the reference pictures I see of Mario holding the peace sign, he's holding the 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 front of his hand? Is that what it's called? The other side of his hand. So you can see his fingers bent over and you know, his thumb bent over. Every picture uh, that I see of Mario holding up the peace sign shows, you know, not he's not holding the back side of his hand up. He's holding the front side of his hand up, if it's called the front side. So I got to stick with this angle. It would have been easier to show the other side, but Mario never holds up a peace sign that way, it seems so. Something still looks weird about this. I think it's the angle of the this finger here, because this doesn't look bad. That is that is better. That is better for sure. Something still looks a little off. I think it's the way this finger kind of tapers in at a severe angle. Getting closer, getting closer, making progress, making things happen and whatnot. All right, so let's make this finger a little bit thicker to match. Oh, God damn it, that was such a nice line too. To match the, uh, and then I'll do something. That just looks weird. Alright, I 
think that's how's that look whoops here we go how's that looking that's not looking too bad actually alright I'll stick with it I think I might actually just use what I have here I'll clean it up a little bit but uh, I think I may as well just use what I've got here because I spent so much time on it so I may as well uh, just use it All right. this up here. I'll get this line back connected. There we go. That took too long, but uh, that's fine. Sometimes things take a while. Okay, so this isn't perfect, but you know what? It's good enough. It's good enough. I'm gonna Mario's shoes. So, actually, I can erase some of this. Make way for his shoes. Shoes have more of a go. That'll do. Yeah, that looks good enough. And now... I'll uh, clean this up here. First and foremost, let's get rid of all these... all of this stuff. Get rid of all of it. Nope, there's still some here. 
All right, and oh, gotta make this line. sec. Okay, so let's see here. Let's get rid of this. Oh, I thought they were done construction for the day, but uh, apparently not. I hadn't heard much noise outside all uh, for the past few hours, but uh, nope, construction has resumed. That's fine. That that'll be fine. Oh, I noticed a little little bit of remnants of the uh, the uh, light gray paint that I hadn't gotten rid of. All right. Yeah, that's looking pretty decent. I'm pretty happy with that actually. Um, so let's. Move him a little further over here, and hold on a sec here. So, For now, for now, that'll be fine. All right, and of course, one last detail, the M on his hat. And the M on his hat is red, so I'll draw that in the red when I, uh, when I make it the color. Uh, make sure there's nothing too messy looking. Okay, let's go in here and neaten up some of this stuff on the hand. Do the one pixel uh, brush. Nothing too bad. Nothing too bad going on here. Just a couple little squares there. Uh, let's get rid of this little thing. song stuck in my head. It's a pretty good song though, so I don't mind when good music is stuck in my head. It's always a pain when you have a song stuck in your head that you just you just don't want to be there at all. But uh that's not the case right at the moment, although I'll probably say that in two minutes later it'll probably my brain will decide that I need to start listening to some really the, some song that just really gets on my nerves but right now that's not the case so that's good there we go let's make sure all the little so I can get rid of that too uh, Actually, you know what I should do? Ah, right, well, yeah, I should, uh... Yeah, there we go. Um... Yeah, this is a... This Mario is definitely reminiscent of the Paper Mario version of Mario. At least in my opinion. Never, like I said, never played much Paper Mario, but uh, I did watch. I have seen some Paper Mario 
uh, uh, videos on the internet, so. And I think I had a buddy who played Paper Mario for the 64 way back in the day. And I watched him play that too, once or twice. I can't quite remember if that is the case. Long time ago. Those, those, when, when, when the N64 came out, which was what the original Paper Mario was for, I believe, I'm pretty sure, pretty sure that's the case. Alright, so, now, let's make a palette for Mr. Mario here. As I do with most of my, uh, drawings, it, it seems like a good idea to to get a good color palette going. So how's this for Mario's face? That seems pretty good to me. I don't know, it might be a little little too red, maybe. Slightly slightly reddish. What what about this? That's barely that's barely noticeable. about this. I'll stick with I'll stick with this color for now. That's fine. Alright, uh alright, so now Oh yeah, that's right. They kinda his mustache is like a darker color than his hair, so let's let's do his hair color first. Uh, how's this? Maybe I'll we'll make it a little bit lighter, so I can we can distinguish it from. Yeah, that, that looks pretty good. And let's darken this color a little bit for his mustache. Maybe a little bit more. It's 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 a very dark brown. Yeah. I think it was black in previous games, but I think recently they made it into a darker brown. I think. Not 100% sure on that. Anyways, I noticed one little thing here. Just looks like there's a weird indent in the outline there on the glove, so that's good. Alright, now let's make the blue on his overalls, which is a uh, sort of a jeansy color. Not quite that light. It's not not too far off, but it's actually like more of a blue. Or wait, hold on. Not quite a light blue, but how's that? Eh, maybe a little bit more like that. That's not too far off. Okay, and let's make his shoe color, which is very light brown, almost a, almost, but not quite a tan. Yeah, that's not bad. And then... The soles of his shoes seem to be the same color. 
Although I usually like to make it a different color, a slightly darker color, just for just for visual interest. That's very slight. Let's make it a little bit darker. That'll do, I think. And of course, oh, I just noticed something. Bloop. Let's actually give the inside of his ear a little bit of detail. Nothing too crazy, just like a couple of lines. Something like that. Um, the buttons on his trouser are like a gold color, so let's, let's make a nice like pure yellow sort of color. All right, bloop and bloop. And save the best for last, the color of his shirt and hat. How's this look? Yes, that looks like a pretty close to the Mario Red, if not, well, I doubt it's exactly spot on. I'd be pretty lucky if that was the case, but anyways. And the M on his hat. How's that look? That looks fine-ish. being so particular about this, but uh, I am. Alright, let's let's use a one pixel brush to to detail this a little bit better. It's, it's still going to come out looking kind of not great, but that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. All right, and so there he is. There is the dude who started it all for Nintendo, or at least got the ball rolling. Oh, one last thing. Let's uh, make sure that color is represented too in my little palette. Whoops. Get that over there. I just want to move this. No, I don't want to change it. Because then you get all these weird artifacty little... Uh, I just kind of want to bring it in line with the rest of them a little bit better. There we go. Alright. I 
think, other than, you know, finalizing this image, I think this is ready to be saved and, and, uh, oh wait, hold on, one last detail, one last detail, let's give Mario a shadow, like I do with all my other guys, seems to be a good thing to do. I guess what I could do, I always, hold on a sec here, let's move this over a slight bit, I guess what I could do is just move Mario straight on top of this instead of, yeah, just like that, and then I can move Mario back, there we go. All right, now, <coughs> excuse me, I'll tr try to get this back to, there we go, and there we go, and I'll just center Mario a little bit more, lovely. Save as Mario.png. There we go. I'm pretty happy with that. It's uh, not half bad. I mean, probably shouldn't have taken uh, what is it? One hour, 23 minutes. Probably didn't need to take that long, but that's fine. Um, yeah. So, I guess since that is done, I am done with my stream. Uh, yeah. So, let me just zoom in. There we go. You can get a nice good look at him. Zoom in all the way. Mario is watching you. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe should I do anything with his eyebrows there? No, I think they're fine. I think they're fine. All right. So, I'm done for today. Done with the stream for today. So, thank you anybody who is watching for watching. I certainly appreciate it, um, and I hope to see you in the next one. See you later. Bye for now. I don't know how to end these streams. <laughs> Still got to find a way to a neat little uh, bye message so that I don't have to keep thinking of a different way to say bye every time. Thank you so much for watching. I'll s I hope to see you in the next one. Bye for now. Yeah, something like that. Bye. <laughs>